Hey guys, it's Mike. If you've watched my past videos, you already know how to set up and install an Unraid 6 server for your home or small business. You know how to set it up as a file server or media server or whatever else you need it for. Now what happens when Lime Technology releases a new version and you need to upgrade? Well, that's actually very easy to do and in this short video I'm going to show you how to do it as well. Let's get started. Hey guys, this is Mike. I just wanted to talk to you about how you can go ahead and uh, keep your Unraid 6 server current. And if you look up here, it shows you on the home screen what your current version number is. In my case, it's 6.1.9. This particular server has been running for 29 days. So I'm going to go ahead and go over to uh, the plugins page. And if you look down here, it tells me Unraid Server OS by Lime Technology. My current version is 6.1.9. My new version is 6.2. And I can go ahead and cl click the little uh, blue eye and it tells me to release notes and everything that's changed in the latest version so I can make the determination whether I should upgrade or not. Uh, and by the way, if it shows you're current here, you can always click the check for updates here as well. And it's gonna go out and basically just check all your plugins, including the operating system itself, to see what your latest version is. In my case, 6.2 is the latest version, and I want this version, so I'm going to go ahead and click Update. So it goes out and it downloads my update for me, and it'll go ahead and install it. Once the plugins finish downloading and installing the new OS, you're going to have to restart your server. It's one of the rare times you actually have to restart an Unraid server. And in order to do that, you have to go to your main screen up here and then scroll to the bottom and you'll see this uh, this button here for stop the stop button itself is grayed out but if you look just to the right you see yes I want to do this so if you click that and then you click stop it'll go ahead and stop your array and that unmounts all your drives so it gives you a status down here, spinning up all drives, stopping services. And you'll, if you have a drive mounted to the server, you'll get a notification from your desktop OS. So your shares have been disconnected. Okay, so once your array stops, your server comes back to basically this screen, which is your maintenance screen where you can add drives, remove drives, and all that happy stuff. If you scroll all the way down to the bottom, right below where you can restart your array, you're gonna see this button that says reboot. It's grayed out, but if you wanna restart it, just go ahead and check this checkbox to the right that says, yes, I wanna do this. It'll activate a system reset. You click reboot, and your system's gonna go offline. And hopefully a few minutes later, it'll come back online and you'll see the new version. And as expected, the server came back up and running. My drive array remounted. And if you look in the upper right corner of the screen, I'm now on version 6.2, so it did upgrade from version 6.1.9. And that's how you go ahead and upgrade your Unraid 6 server. I hope you find this helpful. If you liked the video, please click the like button. And if you like what I'm doing here, I'd really appreciate it if you'd subscribe to my channel. This is Mike Fury. Take care.